Hi guys, today let us do a live analysis on gold. When I was doing this analysis, I have seen an opportunity and I've said, why not share this opportunity with my followers? So if you have been following me, uh, watching my videos, liking this video, by the way, this video is for everyone who has liked my videos in the past. If you have not liked my video in the past, grace upon you. This is for those people who, you know, when you do a video and you see it has 10 likes, 20 likes, 100 likes, like uh, there are these people who have already appreciated. And also these are people for the people who comment on my videos. So you have to understand that once you comment in my videos, you motivate me. So when I was doing analysis on gold, um, I was like, oh my goodness, this is a live trade that I'm about to enter in the next 20, in the next. 40 minutes so if you're watching this video it will be either it has already happened so you have to go and check a uh, gold uh yeah so i said let us first analyze gold because um you need to know where i'm coming from so gold uh basically on the monthly time frame it's a very very strong ranging market and let me tell you the day this ranging market will break if they will break above it will be good why the markets if it breaks above, it will be good. Why? We have we already know where the market will go. And because uh, we are looking for more, more of a buy because it's uh, nearing our resistance, nearing the breaking point. So even if we want to sell, you see the sell side is way below here. So we are looking at uh, we are looking at gold to buy and mm -hmm. to swing trade the buy once that place is broken. But if we look at last month, if you look at last month candle, we have a very bullish engulfed candle. Guys, I don't know if you can see that bullish engulfed candle. This bullish engulfing candle shows us that still buyers are in control and the market wants to continue to buy. It shows us that if at all you are looking for any opportunity in the gold um, setup, you need to look for buy. And that is what... Um, has builded my analysis. So from the monthly perspective, I understand we don't have a swing trade. We don't have a swing direction, but according to short-term trades, the market was a very momentum candle, a bullish angle. And then the third thing that I check from market structure, price action, the last thing I check is the pattern. So here we have a double bottom. Gold has a double bottom, guys. And once gold has this double bottom, you can see where is our where is our neckline this is our neckline our neckline is there so you can imagine gold has an opportunity to go all the way to the neckline why because our half was broken by this bullish candle you can see where our half was it was broken so the market is approaching to the neckline so there's a place where gold will go to 2065 and we are at 1962 Let's see how many pips are those. So um, 1,049, 1, 10, So gold can go 1049 pips. It will go, it can click to, it can hit 2,000. It can go all the way to 20, 2065. That's the way the projection that I'm seeing. So because the monthly time frame has told us to buy, when you go to the weekly time frame, what else are we seeing from the buy opportunity? When we come to the weekly time frame, we can see that the market has broken. Uh, the market broke this this resistance. You can see that the market has broken this resistance, which is very good because it is showing us that the buyers are still in control. And the best thing is that the market has not activated this zone. You know, if the market tapped, if it broke and tapped this zone, we would have been thinking, oh, maybe it's a double top. So the fact that it broke and it never touched here. We are hoping that the market can buy back and come here. That's around 568 pips. So we still on the on the weekly buy is still being confirmed. Let's go on the daily time frame. When we go on the daily time frame, what are we seeing, guys? We are seeing um a market that has been that broke that resistance and it has been retracing. If you're my student and I keep saying this, you already know how we use BWA. For me, I can see a very, very good setup on the BWA strategy. And this is what will tell us that with using BW, BWA, BWA strategy, we have at least, if this candle closes today, today is Thursday, the whole of tomorrow, Friday, 
we have a buy entry just by using BWA strategy. So if you're my student already, this trade is the one that you, you can get in and at least hold the trade for at least one day. And you can see uh, when you're holding this trade for one day, the market can come back to where it broke and that's almost 230 pips. So first, the first thing that is making us to enter a buy, the double bottom on monthly. The second thing that is making us to, to, to see a buy opportunity, the resistance break on weekly. The third thing that is making us to enter the buy, the BW strategy on daily. Can you see guys? Now, once all is said and done, once all is said and done, because this is what we have after we have the BW strategy, I flipped, I went to flip on the four hour strategy. So as I was flipping on four hour strategy, and this is something that everyone here will benefit, either you're my paid student or not. Remember my course, I charge $400. That $400, you can either choose an online course, which is recorded, or you can choose a mental, a physical class, which is physical. And you have to be in Kenya, of course, to attend physical class. So if, you, if you're my student, there's so many reasons for you to buy. But if you're my follower here on YouTube, I want to show you something else. So I want to delete this. Let me delete this. And this is where the market is, guys. This is what the market is. I want to show you that I have a double bottom. Can you see this double bottom? I have taught this here. I have a double bottom. So once I have this double bottom, um, I get my neckline. Can you see my neckline? That's my neckline. And then once I get my neckline, I check my half. Where is my half, guys? I get my half. So I have my neckline, I have my half, and I have my possible double bottom. Now, everything is making sense here because everyone here understands this language. So don't feel bad if I don't teach you BWA. Just first appreciate on what I've taught you because still you can make money. So um, I want to share with you what I saw on this double bottom. So it's a possible double bottom. And then this possible double bottom, we have to highlight here. I told you the reason why I use this ellipse for highlight, it's for me to identify this double bottom if it is on the other time frame. So this is gold on four hour. This is on gold on four. And I remember, I think I did uh, the analysis and I sent it to my Telegram channel. If you have not joined my free Telegram channel, the link is, is, the, is in the description box below. So this is gold. This is gold on four hour. So basically what I, I, I want you to understand is that this analysis, you analyze and the rest you leave it to God. There's no you can analyze and start thinking, oh, what should I do? I have analyzed. So you have the double, we have the possible double bottom. And we remember on four hour, which strategy do we use? We use CRB strategy. CRB strategy means current resistance break. So we use current resistance break. You can understand that this market is um there is a resistance break here. So already the market has a current resistance break. Can you see that current resistance break? So it means before even we think that if this candle closes is a is a an entry, the question is if I go to the daily guys, do I have a double bottom here? Do I have a double bottom? Oh my goodness. I don't have a double bottom. Can you see? I do not have a double bottom, guys. And to make the matters worse, on the daily, there is nothing like a double bottom because you can see the red candle broke that area. So on the on the daily, we have agreed, no double bottom. On four hour, why is this market giving me a buy opportunity everywhere? Everywhere is a buy opportunity. So if this candle closes at nine, so we are remaining one hour, 28 minutes, by the making of this video. So by the time you're watching this video, I am uploading it right away. So you will you will have to wait at nine to enter this trade. My prayer is this candle not to have activated the take profit. So where we are taking the take profit is here. So it's 147 pips. Guys, all the best. I hope the market will not close. You know, it can be like this and then the candle is like a very big, uh, it's called a what, like a shooting star or something. So we are praying that the candle will at least break this CSB 
PRB, sorry, and our take profit will be here. Our take profit is at 1975. So that's where you take your profit. So we always say that don't take your profit exactly at half. You can reduce it at 1975. Even we can do at 1974. Our take profit, guys, should be at 1974 because we don't want to be exact at the half. Sometimes it does not reach a half. So we are targeting 1974 is our take profit, guys. That's our take profit. So all the best. Hope by tomorrow we will know the fate of this trade. I am waiting to see the fate of this trade. It's at least 116 pips. This is the, the trade that can change your like the way you trade, I have I kept saying, oh, trade these days, trade this way. All the best. Hope to hope you will enjoy this trade. Hope it will be successful. All the best, guys, and see you in the next one. Bye bye. Love you.